It is an incredible honor to uh, uh, have been uh, uh, named one of the scholars for this year. It's an um, uh, intense competition. What this award um, allows me is basically to get a strong start in setting up my lab and um, continuing my research. And basically, at the, for the first uh, couple of years, uh, I will continue looking at the protein responses that cells show upon gaining extra chromosomes. So one of the key projects that uh, my lab is still trying to understand is to identify protein signatures, how the protein network of the cell is affected by the addition of an extra chromosome. It is important to understand the state of uh, being aneuploid or aneuploidy because, because of two, two key observations. One is that if humans during development develop, um, gain an extra copy of a chromosome, is usually lethal to the organism. It's very detrimental. On the other hand, we know for more than 100 years um, that tumor cells are aneuploid. So there's a seemingly paradox uh, observation, paradoxical observation that uh, on the one hand, gaining a single copy of extra chromosome you know, leads to death, whereas you know, tumor cells have many extra copies of chromosomes and they have in incredible growth potential, a key characteristic of, of tumor cells. So my lab is trying to utilize yeast as a model system to ask the question within a cell, what are the cellular processes that are affected when a cell gains an extra copy of a chromosome? I started my position here in September and um, it's a privilege, I feel privileged to be part of this uh, amazing institution. We have a very strong uh, very scientific community that uh, supports uh, the you know, uh, basic research like my lab. It's been incre an incredible experience to interact with the colleagues uh, here because uh, um, already new projects and new ideas, new ideas are bouncing off. And uh, it's just another example that uh, this is just uh, an incredible institution that is the right place for to do basic research.